so we needed to add some kind of storage for our camp chairs and our camp table and we wanted to get it to the exterior of the van but of course the box isn't long enough doesn't have space that we added on so we came up with another solution So today our mission is we are looking for some rooftop storage ideas. We do not want one of the big cargo carriers, so we want a rugged bin. So checking out Home Depot, uh, probably Academy Sports, and also Harbor Freight. We've looked online, they have some options. So we're going to see what we can do and then we'll show you what we get. All right, so as you guys can see, we went to Home Depot, Arbor Freight. Arbor Freight had an option, but it would just be too tight, so we weren't sure if it would work or not. So we ended up just hopping on Amazon. Good thing about being in Florida right now, it's usually just one day delivery, this is two day. Um, but we found an item that'll work. Let me show you guys. So it is a Pelican Vault. And it fits the exact dimensions that we need to fit our two chairs and our table. So when that arrives on Sunday, we will catch up with you guys then and show you how we're going to get that hooked up on the rack on top of the van. So it's been a few days since we uh, filmed the first part of this, uh, but I found this. Pelican vault gun case and using it as a slim storage solution for the roof because I didn't want anything that was higher than the AC. And I also only had about 21, 22 inches of width to play with between my roof vent and my solar panels, the side of the van. Um, I had about 47 inches length. This is a little bit longer than that, but it works because, well, our solar panels honestly don't do much since we have such a big lithium battery system. Our engine charges them. So we never worry about it. Uh, so it covering a few inches of solar panel is okay. So we had ordered that, that came in, but I was waiting on, oh, let's find them in here in the bag. I was waiting on these right here. So these can slide down in and twist. I'll show you guys. All right, climb the ladder here and show you. So I got some, uh, lock nuts, but these right here, focus on that and let's, uh, show you how these work. So these right here are kind of a T they go in and then you turn them. And now you can't come out of here out of these T channels. So I have two there, one on this side, and then I'm going to use that one bolt for my solar panel for that side. So yeah, this is gonna look great up here. As you can see, the space I have right here, not much lengthwise, not a whole lot. So that's what I'm working with, um, but it's gonna work. It's gonna look great, I think. Uh, I'm gonna use those uh, T-bolts. I think they're called T-bolts, T-channel bolts. I'm gonna use those. Some washers on the inside of the Pelican vault case the lock nuts. I am going to use some silicone on the bottom and on the top of the uh, Pelican vault case uh, where that goes through to just prevent water from getting in there. And this is going to be used to store our camp chairs, our camp table, and maybe a few other various things because we do have some leftover space, which is nice. Um, but it's a great solution, I think. And overall, it's actually a fairly cheap solution uh, comparing to like a rooftop cargo box or anything like that. And especially if you're looking for one of the thinner boxes, they're five, six, 700 bucks, 170 on Amazon for this and about another 10, $15, uh, for those T bolts that I needed. So it's a pretty good solution guys. Um, let's just get it up on there see how it works and see if it's a viable solution for 
van lifer is looking for a thin case. So as you can see, I have the case on, the, it's flipped over right now, and I already drilled holes in. As you, you can probably see this line, I marked my line, did my measurements, everything like that. So this should line up perfectly, fingers crossed. So one thing I am doing is I am taking off these handles because I don't want them to flap around at all. So you just push in from here, pops it out, and then you can slide these right out, easy as that. I will give you guys a heads up. This is easier for sure with two people. I'm doing it by myself. I got that side fastened in. I got these ones through on this side. I just gotta twist them, get them to lock, throw some uh, silicone on there, some caulking, um, some washers, and then the lock nuts, and it'll be done. Well guys, I'm here in New Mexico. We made it from Florida all the way here. No issues with the Pelican case. So it is a viable solution for your storage needs under $200. A lot cheaper than the comparable cargo cases or you know other hard cases out there that are anywhere you know from four or 500 up to a thousand plus. So I hope you guys like the short video. Definitely subscribe and drop a comment down below. If you have any storage solutions that are affordable, share it with everybody else. See you on the next one. About to leave, already packing. Come with me, I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see.